Hello everyone, Jake with Optimus Futures here, bringing you another Investor RT video. And in this platform video, we'll be showing you how to open up a dome or a trading dome on this platform. So if you watch our last video, you will have saw how to open a chart on this platform. And you actually do need to open up a chart to open a dome on this platform as well. So because of that, we'll be following the same process. If you're unfamiliar or just want a more detailed explanation of the process, feel free to go back and watch that video on how to open a chart. But for now, I'll just be following a more streamlined approach. So as I mentioned in our last video, there's one of two options to open up a chart. You can either go through the object manager or the open chart button. Either way, it does open up the object manager window. And from here, we can select our chart type. Like I suggested in the last video, I personally like the multi-pane chart. This gives you more of a familiar feel of a chart you may have experience on another trading platform. And I think it's the most simple out of all three. And I'll also be selecting a candle chart for my multi-pane chart. Now from here, we can click on the new button and this will open up the chart wizard. I won't be delving into the settings here. Feel free to go back and watch the last video for a more, more detailed description of this. But for now, I'll just be opening up a E-mini S&P 500 contract for September 2018. And I'll set my ticker symbol as future, of course. And then I'll click on apply to open up a chart. And then once you have a chart open, it's actually fairly simple to open up a dome or a trading dome. Simply right click anywhere within the chart and click on the trade button. And that's it. It will automatically bring up the trading dome. And as you can see here, we have buttons for market bid. We have the bid and ask. On the left side, you'll have your buys. On the right side, you'll have your sells. There's a cancel all. You can flatten here. You can also take a look at what contract you're trading down here. There's a strategy button to apply different strategies, although I don't have any pre-populated at the moment. In the top right, you can close out your dome by clicking on this X. We can open it back up by right clicking, clicking on the trade. Right here, you also have a settings list for the dome chart and you can easily update your chart as well as the dome by either disabling or enabling some of these settings, then clicking on apply and then okay. But that's pretty much it. It's fairly simple to open up a dome on this platform and it's very intuitive as you can see. Thanks for watching. If this video helped, feel free to give it a thumbs up. If you have any further questions, don't hesitate to give us a call or send us an email. Follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more informative content related to the futures market.